So um, I'm taking it all in stride. I'm enjoying every moment of it. And, um, you know, I think we're ready to go. What about DK Metcalf? There's a guy who got drafted, came up big in the, in the playoffs for them and made some big plays. When you see a young guy like that, you talk to your secondary and try to help them out. What can you guys do to try to s slow this guy down? Um, just play disciplined defense, man. Um, obviously, DK is, is a specimen. Um, really good receivers coming to his own right now. Like you said, coming up a big game against Philly, where he made some big plays for that team. Um, game changing plays to be that. So, uh, you know, I think we just have to play good, disciplined defense. Um, I don't think we have to do nothing special, try to do nothing out the ordinary. Just do what we've been doing all year long, um, keeping the guys in front of us and uh, challenging them. That's it. Russell Wilson is a guy who can make plays late in the game. How do you try to, the guy who can still get out of the pocket, run, beat you with his legs, and beat you with yards? You really just have to be mentally ready for that. You know, um, obviously, you know, you can't really prepare for it at practice, what he's going to do in the game. You know, you, you just hope, like I said, we, we just play good team, discipline ball, um, front, you know, able to stay in their rush lanes. And in the back end, you know, we're able to hold up, um, not only for the three seconds that we need to, but for the second play, that's what we call it, you know, um, six to eight seconds. So um, it's always a challenge um, in the back end, but we understand that we have to do it to win this game. So that's what we're prepared on doing. What do you want to establish as a defense? You guys have made some big plays. You can turn the ball over. What do you want to establish with you guys, your unit? Um, just being a sound defense. Um, I mean, we've been, been able to get turnovers all year long. Uh, we've been getting to the quarterback all year long. Um, we've gave up some 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 big plays um, quite a bit throughout the year, but um, toward the latter part of this year, um, we've been keeping those plays at bay, and that's what we got to continue to do. We just got to continue playing fundamentally sound football. If we can do that, um, you know, we don't we don't have to depend on other things. We we just can depend on ourselves, and that's the way we want to play defense. Your first answer, you mentioned the stage that this is for this team. How special is that? As a guy who's been in the league a long, long time, opportunities are difficult to come by. How special is the opportunity here? It is, um, especially for me. I, I, mean, I haven't been in the playoff in four years, so, yeah, in four years, that's unordinary for me. <laughs> <laughs> that's unordinary, but, um, you know, you, you, you learn to value these opportunities. And um, right now, that's what I'm doing right now, just kind of, um, staying in the moment, um, talking to my teammates, letting them know that, I mean, it, it's just another game. Yeah, There's going to be a lot more media, not a lot more publicity to it. But when we get on that field, we have to treat it as another game. And if we can do that, uh, we'll be fine. What do you guys, are you playing with one of the greats in Aaron Rodgers? You guys remember when you went to the Super Bowl run, you had big plays, he had big plays. Do you think about trying to get one of the greats back to the game along with yourself? Come like we talked to Jimmy about just now. Oh, most definitely. Uh, you know, I think he's going to be t depending on us just like, you know, we're going to be t depending on him. So, um, like I said, it's a team game, man. Uh, we have to depend on each other. We understand that it's not a lot of people who like the way we've been winning, you know. We're the worst 13-3 and three team in the world. <laughs> but, you know, um, you know, we, we, we continue to do what we're doing, man. We win ugly however it comes. Um, we have some really good players on this team, really good defense, really good offense, really good special teams. We do everything well, and that's what we count on. We count on, count on our whole team, and we trust everybody. That's what we're going to depend on. Tremont, is this team an is this team the underdog? I mean, I'm, I don't think anyone in here thinks that, but on the outside it seems that way based upon like what you just said. Um, sense of, of, of reaction in here to that? I don't know. It's it's, it's kind of a weird feeling to me. You know, um, I never thought I'd say a team, you know, with Aaron Rodgers behind quarterback would be considered the underdog, you know. Um, but to a degree, yeah, from the outsiders, it, it, it kind of sounds that way. But um, it sounded that way all year long. And we never budge. We never blink. You know, we just continue to do what we do. And that's win games. No matter how it comes, you know, we win games, and um, that's what we plan on doing on Sunday, just coming out and do what we do. The constant word that comes up for everybody is character. How is the character of this team different than other teams you've been a part of? Um, I've been a part of some really good teams, so uh, I don't know. I don't know if that's a tricky question. <laughs> that's a really tricky question, but um, the culture here has always been really good. The character guys that they bring in, 
it's been a part of the culture here. You know, um, I, I think if a guy have bad character, um, those guys tend to shy away from that. So we've always had really great guys here, really, really great character, um, and really strong-minded guys here, like I said, who come in and we win games, and no matter what the circumstances is, we believe in ourselves, so it's the same thing. You have such great respect in this locker room for what you do on the field and the way you carry yourself. What's that mean to you? Um, at the end of the day, that's that's what you want. You, know, um, you want the respect, the respect of your peers um, and the guys around the league. Um, if you have that, and it, nothing else really matters. You know, um, I, I never came in the game, you know, to really worry about, you know, what the outsiders would really think of. You know, um, I just really care what these guys think about me, and, and I really care for, care for them. So as long as we care for one another, that's all I really care about.